I rarely ever fish for walleye. I mean, I don't know much about them. I rarely ever fish for them. And I haven't fished for them in two years. And two years ago, I fished for them a couple, three times. And that's the first time in 40 years, so. I'm gonna go down, see if I can locate a walleye. The striper fishing, my favorite lake is the doggo. Tough right now. There's so few and far between. I just thought I'd come out here to this big, beautiful, hard to fish rascal. <laughs> See what I can do today. There's not a, surprisingly enough, there's very few people here at the ranch. The next few days, right? Uh, over the holiday weekend, it'll be outrageous. Now I ask you, is that beautiful or what? <laughs> beautiful more. The absolute beauty <laughs> of this lake is incredible. Without a doubt, one of the most beautiful lakes ever. The absolute biggest surprise to me. I got the lake to myself. <laughs> That's incredible. <laughs> and I hadn't caught any fish yet either, so maybe that's the reason I got it to myself. Nobody else has been catching any. Maybe that's the maybe that's the reason. My gosh, it is gorgeous out here this morning. Anyway. Fishing a, a blade bait right, to, right at the moment. It's got to produce out this bar here. I've seen a few fish on the sounder, but I don't <laughs> Who knows what they are? beauty of this lake that makes it so attractive to people. <laughs> it's certainly not the good fishing. <laughs> it's some tough fishing on this rascal. But it is but it is a a beautiful lake. mostly surrounded by national forest. It's just beautiful. Hmm. Clear water, national forest, makes it very attractive to people and all. <laughs> that clear water makes it a little bit difficult on the catching too. It can be tough, that's for sure. Yeah. <laughs> I 
to say this is a tough fishing lake would be a, a drastic understatement. At times, yeah, you can you can do good on certain species. Even at best, it's a tough lake. Tough. Like all high, clear highland lakes. Tough. Nothing unique about it. It's just it's a clear highland reservoir. I mean, it's tough. There's a, I'm coming up over a deep hump that I've caught all I off of before. Let's see if there's anything here today. There hadn't been anything on anything at other place. And I've fished three or four really good structures. Pump on. Try to pump out the water. As it comes in, but it's coming in quick.
gracious. It was raining or storming. I decided to get out of the middle of the lake. Heard that thunder and lightning. Yeah. I decided to get off the water. <laughs> I don't know why I even came out in it in the first place. It didn't act like I had good sense. Great. It was pouring down rain. Well, I launched the boat. I wonder about me sometimes. <laughs> I really do. I'm just getting ready to go back out. Another clap of thunder. It looks like it's breaking up. Back in the west, aren't you? I'm gonna Turn this bilge pump on. Some of water. <laughs> Some more of this water out. <laughs> this boat has been full of water. I mean, it was a frog strangling rain. Gracious. bass was 30 some feet deep about 34 foot deep <laughs> that's unreal how deep everything is Big right like crazy. He was a mighty big one, or really nice one. He's foul hooked one. There he goes, taking a line again. Lord have mercy. Gain a little line, lose a little. Oh, heaven, Bethy. Good fish.
Come on, bud. Come on. Maybe it slowed down a little bit. Ah, land. Look at that fish. Holy moly. Holy cosmoly. He's a monster. He is a monster.
think he's as big as that other one. He's a nice fish. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Hey. Hey. What's happening? <laughs> I finally found some. Huh? I finally found some. Oh, did you? Yep, just now. As a matter of fact, I just now landed one that just got the boger grips on him right now. Oh, okay. Oh, my well, God. Oh, my God. And the screen is lit up there under me like crazy. Will you go ahead? I'll talk to you later. All right, Bill. <sighs> oh. been a tough day. A real tough day. But I finally got my, my 
did I ever have to work for it? Yes, I did. <laughs> Boy, did I ever have to work for what I got today. I mean, whew. it was tough. Tough, 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 tough day. My gosh, I am terribly <laughs> tempted. Drop back right down there and get another one around. If I do, that water's 83 degrees. I mean, <laughs> that's just one or two. The screen has been absolutely lit up with. <laughs> oh my. Now, <laughs> when you work as hard as I work to try to get these things, and then you find them, I just. <laughs> It's hard to make yourself go off and leave them. I mean, I've got a school. I've been looking for them like crazy, and there's a, a big school, a big fish below it. Uh, but it would, would not be good catching up. You limits two. And I've already got two. If you fight another one up out of that deeper, cooler water, fight them up into this warmer surface water, they ain't gonna survive. They won't make it, so. Jerry, I wish you'd been here with me today. But I got my limit, and I swear that, I mean, that, there was a heck of a school under there. A heck of a school. They're around here somewhere still. If you'd have been here, we'd have got our limit. Got your limit too. Uh, and you got to work for them. Whenever you find them, it's worth it. It was a hard, hard day. <laughs> it wound up being a great day. Head to the house. <laughs> Been a good day.
<laughs> I could use some help, you know. Again, like I said. Oh, oh man. <laughs> oh. It's hard to hold up. <laughs> yes. Oh my. Oh, <laughs> yes. Oh, that is gorgeous. What does he weigh? Uh, a bunch. I don't. Oh know. Lord, Dennis. I break my hand here holding it. That's a oh. huge fish. Yeah, that's a big striker. This one. Oh. <laughs> is a big hybrid. Holy cow. Nice hybrid. Yeah. Very nice striper. Holy moly, Dennis. <laughs> Did you get them? Yes, I got them. Oh, good, because I put them down there breaking my heart. 